thyroid. It's a tiny butterfly-shaped gland that you probably never give in a second thought. But when it gets out of whack, it causes people big problems. Most time, it's because they have a mass in their thyroid. They feel it, or sometimes they have problems swallowing, and occasionally have strider or respiratory wheezing from the thyroid problem because it's compressing on the windpipe. It's estimated 12% of the U.S. population will develop some type of thyroid problem. Many can be treated with drug therapy unless there's a cancerous mass or it causes difficulty in the throat. Our typical workup is we get an ultrasound with a biopsy. And if that shows suspicious for cancer or cancer, then we would do surgery. Other times we do surgery again if it's compressing the uh, swallowing tube. Having a thyroid that just doesn't work right is the more common scenario. An underactive or overactive thyroid impacts the body's hormone production. The overactive or hyperthyroidism is the more common condition and more difficult to manage. So in many instances, surgeons will remove the gland entirely through a minimally invasive procedure. Rather than incision from one side of the neck to the other, we may make an incision an inch or less, uh, a curvilinear incision at the base of the neck in a skin crease. It's done in a skin crease to hide the scar the best. While the thyroid plays an important role in stabilizing metabolism, it can be replaced, with medication doing what the body could not, leaving patients to a normal life. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.